Good morning, everybody. Okay, so I kind of wanted to do a little video about, um, I know a lot of people call them Dollar Tree hauls, but this one, I actually use these all the time for my garden. Um, I buy the buckets and uh, these little basket thingies. Um, and I will show you how I use them in the garden. Uh, first thing, I fill one of these up with water and then I put the basket inside and then um, you know there'll be like water um, when I'm cutting my lettuces or anything that wilts um, because I'm in the desert right now it's 107 and I think it's yeah it's it's barely uh, nine o'clock in the morning um, so it's extremely hot so when I'm harvesting my lettuce and everything and if I just you know put it down on the ground and turn around and start harvesting something else it starts to wilt right away so with these I can even actually put some ice cubes um, in the water I wouldn't put them in the basket but I would put them in the water on the bottom of the bucket and then set the bucket on top of the ice cubes with the water in it just to keep the water nice and crisp and cold so when I harvest my um, and yes I'm still harvesting lettuce for my tortoises and things like that um, kale uh, that actually does well in the heat um, wilts extremely fast as soon as you cut it so um, this actually helps me and these are now at the Dollar Tree um, I bought all of these yesterday at the Dollar Tree they have different colors but these are like my favorite colors so um, I'm gonna be putting these and I actually use the, the totes because they're actually a pretty good size. I put them throughout my yard for birds. Um, we have huge crows uh, that live in our area that actually help me with uh, rodents. So they come down for water all the time. I actually feed them as well. Um, you know, leftover scraps and leftover dog food or whatever. Um, so they will come down and they will drink out of these too. Um, like I said, desert life, a lot of things in the desert will come to our land because I have vegetables and everything growing, which is fine. I don't mind as long as they're not eating my vegetables. Um, and nine times out of 10, they just want shade from the heat and they want water. Um, water is number one thing. Um, so that being said for I think I got three of these and two of these five bucks I got my own little watering station and these are actually pretty big I mean I can fit a bunch of lettuces and vegetables when I cut my zucchinis and stuff like that I put them at the bottom before the lettuces and it just you know however long I'm outside it just helps with the things wilting and getting hot and yucky and you know so they have, I think they had red ones. Um, I know they have these green ones. And then they had, I think, purple ones. Uh, but they're going fast. So I just wanted to let you guys know, for five bucks, I got three bins and two baskets. I could have got more baskets, but I only need, I have I already actually have a basket outside um, in my garden. But um, I, I wanted to get more of these for watering throughout the, throughout my land. <laughs> so Dollar Tree, find, or uh, haul, whatever you want to call it. Um, I just want to let you guys know so you can run on down there. So when you're, har oh, and also these have little handles. So if you want to just take your whole harvest, you know, shake it off the water or whatever, let it drain so much. And then you can br just bring this basket in the house, set it in the sink, let it drain, drain a little bit more. And you actually have a harvesting basket plus, you know, the bucket to keep it nice and cool. So I just think it's awesome. And for, if you just wanted to get one for two bucks, you know, a dollar for this one, a dollar for this one. I mean, it's a pretty good deal. Also, I just wanted to show you my little experiment. Um, I, I put so much stuff in this little glass and like everything grows in, in this little glass. I love it. Um, this is one of my tomato, uh, what do you call those suckers? I just stuck it in the glass in water, put a... Um, one of these cheapy, you know, the ones that, I think I got a salad in this or something. And then um, 
Oops, something's burning. Okay, there we go. And then um, I just stuck it through the lid. I will probably cut the lid off. Um, but look at it. Look how cute. And I got another little second, um, I think this is a robin tomato. I think it's a determinant. De I don't know how you say that. Determinant tomato. So it's like a little bush. It won't get any bigger but it, it puts off the tiniest little little um i think they're like i don't know about that big of tomatoes and they're actually pretty good my mom likes them so i have one outside this was the sucker that came off of it and i stuck it in there to grow a second one so i would be putting that in the garden so i just wanted to give you guys a little um you know i'm trying to help out anybody especially me i <laughs> i can't afford the big high dollar baskets and these ones yeah, they're not as good as like the rubbery ones that you get at, like tractor supply or whatnot. But I mean, for like three dollars less than the one at tractor supply, I think I will, you know, I'll, I'll use it for a couple years probably. They're not that bad. I mean, they're pretty good. They're a little bit harder than tractor supply, but you know, hey, you can only buy what you can afford. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, I just want to let you know that. Thanks. Have a good day. I almost forgot. I'm sorry. Harbor Freight has these solar rope lights on sale for $7.99. Completely solar. I know. I'm about to scream. You see that I circled it. <laughs> um, I have one in my front yard, and I love it. Um, it's It just follows the pathway. Um, but I'm probably going to go get some more for my garden so I can hang it on my trellises. So that's gonna look pretty. I just wanted to share, share it with you guys. Um, and then also, um, I don't know if you guys use these gloves. I love these gloves. Um, they are awesome. I'm sorry, my camera is so zoomed in and that's as far as it'll zoom out. Um, but these gloves are awesome. I usually get them when they're on sale a little bit better than that, but that's a pretty good deal for a pair. So if you guys need some heavy duty gloves, not really heavy duty, but I mean, if you're like grabbing metal in the heat, these help. If you're like um, grabbing, um, I don't know, things with thorns, like um, I have a bunch of rose bush bushes in my front yard. These actually help. The top will still get poked, your, your top of your hands, but the bottom is like rubber, so you can grab things with it. So for $1.49, not bad. Um, and I think that might be it. Oh, um, we also use these shop lights, which are awesome. They are major bright. And they are actually on sale for 20 bucks, which is normally what we buy them for. Um, but we've redone our entire garage in these lights instead of the big bulky ones. And it is, I want to say, 50% brighter. We took out, I think, four lights and put two of these in there and it's 50% brighter than those four. So, um, those are awesome. So these are all at uh, Harbor Freight. Oh, and you get a free little uh, battery light, which is awesome for like closets that don't have lights and stuff like that. I think I gave my brother one for his safe because his, he's got a gigantic safe. And uh, he's like, I can't see in there. So he just stuck that to the side and he could flip it on and off and he says it's awesome. So. I just want to let you guys know that too. Also, always remember if you're going to buy something big that's, you know, not on the you can't, you know, buy list. But always use your 20% off coupon. There's the online coupon code and the barcode if you need it. Um, but yeah, they've got a bunch of stuff in here that's, you know, on sale right now. I don't know what else anybody else needs, but, you know, they're all in here. On sale, check them out. I think you can go online and get all these coupons as well. Um, I get the email because we shop here frequently. I can't afford high dollar stuff, but you know, I mean, that's awesome. I think if I'm building something, I'm getting that. <laughs> Just to step up and down. Oh, I think Loom, I'm not sure if he has this one, but Lumina Acres is using this to build his barn. If you guys haven't checked out Lumina Acres, He's got an awesome YouTube channel. I just love him to death. And I see him using one of these. I don't know if it's this one, but he uses one of these all the time for his builds. Um, and oh, and he also, I believe, uses the gloves that I just showed you guys.
which are actually nice because they like I think he's putting on metal tin and um, he's he's even saying wow that they got good grip and stuff like that so um, yeah if you guys need some stuff uh, backpack sprayer on sale look there you go I think that's a, oh that's a four gallon wow that's a big one for 20 bucks hey there you go guys if you need to get that spray on everybody needs a sprayer in the garden but you know what I have <laughs> let me show you what I got <laughs> I got this sucker I know it's extreme but it's a Ryobi it's a sprayer it's battery powered I love this thing it's only a gallon I think they have another one for that's two gallons it's a, a little bit more um, but I just wanted a gallon because I don't want to haul around two gallons of stuff I'll just come in and it's got um, a super long sprayer um, the other thing is is that if you um, there's paperwork inside that they say that they will give you um, all of the stuff you know when you spray for free for life so make sure you fill that out if you get one of these I love this sucker I think I paid $60 for it and it came with the battery and the charger um, so I will use that for years and years and years but if you only want to spend the 20 bucks then get that one sprayer from Harbor Freight um, I don't know what else you guys want to see up in here those mats are pretty good my boyfriend has a few of those and yeah that's it so if you guys uh want to check out harbor freight do it i will probably be going in a couple minutes <laughs> thanks guys have a good day